You are watching Yay or Nay Reviews, where we take two minutes to answer one question. Should you see it? Two estranged brothers are recruited into an international MMA contest, both for the $5 million cash prize and fighting each other. The trailer tells you everything you need to know about this movie. It's a sports movie. Rocky meets the fighter, but not quite as good. It's supposed to be a story about redemption and forgiveness, but in the end, it comes across as the story of Cain and Abel. If instead of killing him, Cain beats Abel within an inch of his life and then decides, what the hell? Let's blame it on dad. The movie is long. It's over two hours and it could have been told in about 90 minutes. You know, it should have been told in 90 minutes. And unfortunately, because it's so long, it's very easy to lose interest in what's actually happening. Warrior tries to tell the story of these two brothers who are estranged and their journey getting into the competition. But the trailer and all of the marketing already tells us, A, that they make the competition, and B, that they have to fight each other in the end. So why put a 90 minute lead up to what we already know? The acting wasn't bad, the story wasn't bad, even the writing wasn't that bad when you get down to it, but the fact that half the movie was filler, well, it needed more action and fewer 10 minute long training montages. After all the preamble, when you finally get down to the fights, it's worth it. Tom Hardy, Nick Nolte, Joel Edgerton, they're all phenomenal actors. I could have loved this movie. And I should have loved this movie with all the Oscar buzz that's surrounding it. Instead, I wound up just liking it, as a friend. Make it a cheap Tuesday, and yay. Tell us what you think. Leave us a comment below or come and talk to us on our website, shouldyouseeit.com. Then join us over on Facebook where we post exclusive outtakes from the reviews.